Well, damn, who the hell pissing 6 9 cereal? Hey, man, a lot has gone down since the situation with 6 9 and Perkyo and Steve will do it. Uh, it's, it's, it's been a lot of shit going on. But, but listen, we're going to get into all that. This is another update with States. Please make sure you smash the like button and subscribe if you're new. And make sure you go ahead and hit that notice bell too. And go over to States.shop once this video is over. 20% off the entire site. You know, when you're really on your purpose, you got to throw in the overly dedicated purpose tee. And this right here is just $25. And listen, an additional 20% is off that bad boy. So go ahead and check out stay stop shop just go ahead and get right just throw some things in your goddamn shopping cart and just see you see what all come out to but let's go ahead and get into the video so steve would do it is playing damage control after everyone's pissed off with his stupid decision to go ahead and be used by six nine he feels like he was used so he took the opportunity to go on brandon marshall's um podcast i am athlete alone with shady mccoy and the Kara city brethren omar kelly and check this out right here I'm not filming or doing anything with 6 9 anymore. There you go. Because, like, because here's the thing. With me, if someone, if, if some, if someone does something to me where they, like, use my name, right, and then the consequences I got is I'm getting death threats and mm -hmm. I'm looking like this bad guy when I had no in ill intention, I would kind of, I would cut them off. Right. There you go. Honestly. And you know, I'm here. I'm telling my friends, my girlfriend, everyone. It's like, you know, no one just gets a pass because they're they're famous or whatever. It's like, I, I I'm I do a lot of good, and everyone loves me and everything. And for for me to for someone to use my name and put me in a situation to that where to where I don't understand and I would never want to be a part of and now I'm getting all this hate and everything like if you want to see the full thing just go over to I am athlete check that out over there um it was an interesting conversation it was very cringy it was um it was a little, a little like a scolding they was not letting off on Steve but Steve did deserve a scolding but I definitely understand where he's coming from if he is that green like that I think in some cases he probably is playing a little dumber than he is I think he understands a lot more than what he's portraying as far as like what situation he put himself inside but with him cutting off 6 9 I guess that's you know that's a big step for him but 6 9 don't like that shit he's pissed off when he sent Brandon Marshall a very nasty text message or oh, this is a DM he's Said, yo, to you and the dude in the red shirt that interviewed Steve, not the guy with the dress, suck my whole. I'm pretty sure that says his penis. Steve didn't know you was belittling him and laughing at him, not with him, but I peeped. Suck my dick. And that's why you are where you at right now, holding on to something you would never have again a career. Lying about SF FS1 wanting you on TV after you retired, you're effing bum. Nobody even knows you'll bring you up when they talk about you, just another dude who made it to the league you should have cut your nasty dress you would have been on tv not just on youtube but brandon marshall responds and says i may need to rethink my career path trolls are now mad at me six nine i walked away checked the paperwork and yes i'm a youtuber youtube the second page is my text with fs1 and steve would do it i guess he peaked the vibes from his interview with them boys over there i am athlete and he did this shiesty shit and posted the pivot podcast the pivot podcast they are members um, they're former members of I Am Athlete. They started their own podcast with the addition of Ryan Clark. So he put great people, great podcast, simply. Now, this is the same shit, Steve. You acting like you don't know nothing about sports and shit, but then you go ahead and do some shit right here. You know these people got a little beef going on. You go ahead and post some shit like this, act like you don't understand beefs. You don't understand what's going on. You're just playing dumb. And here you go again, being shady. Doing some trolly shit. Steve, just walk away. Just walk away, G. This made me think like maybe it was all just damage control when you were talking earlier. Like, I don't know. I don't know, Steve, but um, let's go ahead and keep pushing the narrative forward. So Perkyo, Perkyo, he out here um, trying to make music now. We ain't listening to that shit. That shit trash. But you know, some things did happen. You know, Perkyo is Haitian, and um, Six Nine is frequenting areas down here in Miami, Florida. And recently, that shit caught up to him. Like two days later, them boys they caught him in a club and they put, yeah, they put them hands on Six Nine. They caught him right in the kisser, right in the jaw. You know. 
right in the jaw for that situation with Perkyo. Because, you know, taking advantage of that little kid that's not really, you can't really defend himself, bro. Why are you putting in that situation? So people didn't like that. A lot of people didn't like that. And he's Haitian and, you know, quick retaliation. Nice little quick, quick punch in the jaw. Nothing too much. You, you, you ain't got to get killed. Nobody got to go to jail. That situation just simple as that. Simple as that. Now he knows. I can get touched. I can get touched. All that can't be touched shit, you can get touched. Right on your fucking jaw. But um, Perkyo says, just for fun, and that's what happens when you mess with the Haitians. And yeah, that's that right there. And in the meantime, Little Dirk is doesn't know what the hell's going on, and he's on his tour. And... <laughs> looking as confused as ever <laughs> it looks like this person is um you know going through a lot hopefully that lady is okay it looks like that's, that's a sports bra hopefully that lady is okay man um yeah <laughs> this is so funny not funny but funny shit but let me know what you guys think in the comment section below this has been another update with stace make sure you smash the like button and on your way out go ahead and check out stace.shop if you're not going to check out the next video that's going to be on these end cards make sure you go again to stace.shop 20 percent off the entire store these tees only 25 dollars so imagine what everything else is looking like man go ahead and have fun over there it's your boy stacy and i fuck with you and the reason why because you you, you fucks with me. Yeah, you. I'm out.